The Caspian Sea has always been famous for the ambitious project of producing caviar. Iran was once the world's biggest exporter of this luxury food and sold more than 40 tons of sturgeon eggs in the year 2000, though exports plunged remarkably due to dwindling fish stocks and the trade sanctions imposed on Iran. In the year 2010, countries bordering the Caspian Sea agreed to lift the ban on sturgeon fishing for five years and are likely to extend the period this year. However, the 5 plus 1 deal has given high hopes for a revival in this exclusive business. Several small-scale sturgeon farms have popped up across Iran in recent years. Mr. Ashaq Islami is the manager of the private Qarre Burun Caviar Fish Farm in the coastal village of Goldasht, 300 kilometers north of Tehran. ماده خاویار استثال شد و از مادی نر اسپرم شو گرفتیم میریزیم داخل دستگاه بعد از این دو هفته سه هفته ادغام اسپرم با تو تبدیل به مایع لار میشه این مایع لار به مرور زمان بعد از چند ماه به مایع پنج گرم و ده گرم میرسه مازاد ماهی ها به صورت فروش به بخش های خصوصی هست چون ارزشش از ارزش نفت هم بالاتر مثلا یک کیلو خاویار الان در حال حاضر برابری میکنه با 15000 لیت نفتی که در داخل کشور ما تولید میشه به خاطر این ارزشش کم از طلا نیست به خاطر همین میگن که طلای سیاه همین به خاطر ارزش دلاریشه The farm is able to breed half a million sturgeon fingerlings a year filling its pools with water pumped in from the Caspian Sea The two main types of caviar are beluga and ocitra, the rarest and most expensive, costing up to $5,000 per kilogram, is from beluga sturgeon that swim in the Caspian Sea. It can range in color from pale silver gray to black. Next in quality is the medium-sized gray to brownish ocitra, which is one of the most desired types of caviar in the world. It can look, smell, and taste a little different each time you try it due to abundant varieties. The texture is silky, yet separate eggs hold together well in a mass. The Ocitra sturgeon fish found mainly in the Caspian Sea, whose caviar continues to be the most popular, is usually harvested in Iran or Russia. The sturgeon reaches maturity at around age 15, but can live up to 80 years and can weigh from 50 to 400 pounds. Mr. Ramin Rastakhiz is the owner of Iranian Caviar House, a company specialized in exporting Iranian caviar. Traditionally, uh, Western Europe uh, has been a uh, main uh, consumer of Iranian caviar. Uh, the Persian Gulf Arab nations, uh, U.S. used to be a, a large market, 
uh, and recently we are working to open up that market again to reach it uh, and uh, Southeast Asia is also a new open market Japan used to be a uh, fan of Iranian caviar uh, the good thing is you know uh, we can now export to uh, other open markets such as Brazil or even India. Uh, it's not a product for everyday use, uh, but we're working on it. I am now at Iranian Caviar House, one of the first companies in the private sector in Iran in the business of exporting Iranian caviar. As you can see, this is the place where marketing takes hold and Iranian caviar is exported to other countries. Nasser Salari, Mejdanadra Buzrania, Tehran, Iran.